This is the new firmware version 1.7.33 on the Arcos 5 internet tablet with Android. And what I'm going to show you right now is that hackers on the forum have released a really easy way to install the Google Marketplace. All you have to do is copy this file, marketforarcos.apk. You just copy it over using the USB cable from your computer. This is the only thing you need to do. Then you click on it and it's going to install. It's that easy. It says here, do you want to install this application? You just click install. It's very, very easy. You see, it's installing. And then it says application installed. Then you open it. So now it's going to ask, do you want to install Google applications or do you want to remove Google applications? Well, we want to install them. So you click install and it says in order to save some storage space, this application will be replaced by an uninstaller only. After completion, reboot device. So it's pretty cool the way that the hacker has done this. The application you are installing will be placed on our application. Uh, all the previous users that would be saved. So you do like this. Uh, basically, what what happens now is that uh, uh, you can see it it is installed on on the Arcos. So what you do is that you have to actually reboot the the Arcos. That's the only thing you need to do. So let's reboot. You go power off and you do reboot. And once once it has rebooted there will be the full Google Marketplace. So it takes about 30 seconds. Let me and there's just about to be completely booted up. So when it's booted up, it'll ask to calibrate the touchscreen again. So we've calibrated the touchscreen. And then it says calibrate the accelerometer. So you put it on a table, you click the button and it has calibrated. And then it, it asks, uh, make sure you've read the legal and safety notices. Yeah, we've done that. Uh, the Android going to be installed. Uh, okay, okay. You just click okay, and then it says "Welcome to Arcus 5." Touch Android to begin. Uh, important things you need to understand. Blah blah blah. You click, you click, you sign in. I'm going to sign. And next, and next, and now. What is happening is, you have Gmail, you have Google Maps, you have Google Talk. They are right there. You have the market as well. They're all right there. They're all installed. So you can just click and they will they will just work. You can install Google Mail and stuff like that. So let me just uh, activate my Wi-Fi. So there we have the Google Marketplace is now installed on the Arcos 5 internet tablet and I have uh, uh, configured a few things so you have the shortcuts for power. I put the Gmail, the Google Maps, the Google Talk, File Manager uh, have some widgets and some shortcuts. There's a smart shortcut here so you can get directly to your Wi-Fi uh, access points in one click from the desktop uh, which you do by holding down and then you go in shortcuts and then you go in uh, settings and you can choose all these settings that you want to have as shortcuts. It's just uh, one of the nice features of the new Android. Uh, let's go right here back and uh, there is uh, battery use also which is a new feature of the new Android it kind of says what is going on uh, what is using power uh, so it says Wi-Fi is using 34% uh, device idle which I don't know exactly what it means Android system somehow is using 32% and the display is only using 2% which I don't really understand because the display should use a lot of power I mean there's I put this display in full brightness, so I'm not sure, maybe it doesn't really count the display right right now. Uh, so then you can kind of think about this, and then you can uh, think about turning some things off. You want to turn off GPS, or turn off, I don't know if this is automatic notifications, or stuff like that. Um, and then you have the, the market, of course. Market is right there available, and I get my emails. Uh, the, the the emails show up right there as notifications. You can get sounds, and you get the cool Google Maps. And uh, the new Google Maps has um, a really cool uh, uh, GPS working. It actually found my location, and it's absolutely accurate. It just knows where I am. So it basically means that the GPS is now totally fixed. Arcos has fixed it, which is awesome.